Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Salesperson. This is Rohit and I hope you are good and doing well. Today I'm going to show you the Summer 23 new LWC directory that is called LWC colon spread. And this directory is very useful nowadays and split property to a child component enable elements and to accept an object that bounds a property at runtime. Define your property in your components in JavaScript and we can use it. So how to do that? let me show you here so before that if you are new in this channel so please subscribe the channel please turn on the bell icon for more updates so you never be miss any kind of update from my side and uh, please watch this video until end if you want to learn something new so let's get started without any further delay so first of all i need two component i want to create two new lwc component uh, like uh, parent child and then we will see this example in the picture so let me create one component first so if you are using window so you can just use inside vs code control shift p and create lightning web component so my component name is component 1 component 1 so this is first component like this and i'm treating this component as a parent component and second component is component 2 component 2 and this second component is treated as child component so first of all let me include that kind of property inside my you know child component so this is my child component under here let me add some property here it's a api decorator and this api decor decorator you have to include in the top here you can see i already use it like api name and api is an api email something like that like email right so let me use this these all property inside my html so just open it and open the html file under here let me create the card and here let me maintain like lwc or lwc spread something like that under here let me remove unwanted HTML let me create one div and this div contain the class SLDS margin so we can use margin SLDS margin around medium under here uh, I want to use that kind of you know property like name is here so just you can use like name colon you can bind the variable like is after that you can use br tag and then is and br and then you have to use like email right and then email let me change to name to is let me save this so our child component is ready now i want to use this child component inside my parent component that is called component one before that let me add some property here like object property let's say obj equal to this one under here let's say name property we already use right so under here let's say my name is rohit kumar and uh, like is 25 email i can give like rohit at the red gmail dot com right so this is the object because these property we already define inside our child component now same thing i can use these property inside my parent using this object notation so once you added this object notation here just you have to use this object inside your html parent html so just open the parent html under here let's say card and under the card let me maintain like parent this one and uh, let me remove it and let me add one div under this div let me add one SLDS class that is called margin here and margin around medium so under here I want to use my second component inside here so how to use that very simple you can use any child component inside parent using kebab case so my child component name is component 2 so you have to use like component 2 let me remove this property for now so this one and here this time we are using new directory that is called lwc spread 
and this directive contain whole object. So how to use that? Let me show you here. So once you use this LWC spread, after that you have to pass your object here, right? So under here, we have to pass the object, let's say this one and like OBJ. So once you pass this object, now this component contain this, you know, like object property and this object property we already defined under the uh, children, child object that is called name is uh, like email and after that it automatic print this kind of things, right? So under this parent component, we already define some data, initialize the data and we already display here, right? So how to use it inside Salesforce? Very simple, just you have to expose this component so you can open metadata file under here you have to maintain this is exposed true and target lwc record page app page and home page because i want to use this component inside these three pages record page app page and home page let me deploy child component first please keep in your mind this is a very most important if you are using like parent child relationship or child to parent relationship so always deploy your child component first right so let me deploy child component otherwise you will be get an error right so just let me deploy this child component first and once we deploy this child component after that you have to deploy your parent component now successfully deployed now let me deploy parent component here just deploy this one and once we deploy this parent after that we can use inside our salesforce so just successfully deploy let me open my org under here you can open any kind of record page and page home page so right now i'm using like account so just click on this account tab and here you can see account tab under the account we have lots of you know records so let me open any records here and once you open the record just you have to add it this one this page so just click this gear icon added this page once you added it it's automatic open your lightning app builder page and this is the lightning app builder page and visual editor so under the custom we have lots of lwc component just you have to drag and drop your component so we already have like component one just drag and drop anywhere as you want right so just here like this here so i just paste it here save it and just go back oh let me save this first so it's taking some time now saved just go back and once you go back here immediately you can see the output inside our child component that is called here lwc spread using this kind of object property like name is email uh, maybe like uh, some data is missing let me correct it so under here name under the parent under the child we have name is email so we have to use like name so just save it again you have to deploy it or also we can use like child child component for example purpose right just save it deploy it once you deploy we, we will see this kind of output inside our parent component so just let me refresh it and let's see it's working or not so let me refresh this page and after that you can see this is the parent component under the parent this is the parent under the parent we have child component so this is the child component here to here right so let me show you this one this is very most important so here if you see this is the parent component and this is the child component here to here right and with the help of a new directory that is called LWC spread, we can sort the data like this. Okay, so guys, I hope you learned something new in this video. If you feel like this is a very more informative for us, so please subscribe the channel and please turn on the bell icon for more updates so you never be miss any kind of update from my side. So till then, bye bye, take care, see ya. Thank you for watching, guys.